This week marks the beginning of the busiest travel season of the year. Flying is more expensive than ever, especially with several carriers issuing new baggage fees. We've learned airlines raked in more than $3 billion in bag fees last year alone, and those costs only go up when your luggage is overweight. But how do you know the scales that weigh your bags are even accurate? Are you being overcharged? We sent Eyewitness News reporter Nika Nwosu to find out. We wanted to know if your bags are getting a fair deal when you travel. So we called in the experts and obtained copies of every test performed on the baggage scales at TF Green. Before travelers check their bags at the airport, many say they also check their bags at home. Do you ever weigh your suitcase at home to make sure it's underweight? Yes, yes. always, always. If we think it's close, we'll weigh it. We've learned every major airline charges passengers for luggage weighing more than 50 pounds, with fees ranging from $50 up to $200. But how do you know the scales weighing your bags are accurate? Bob Dunning is a licensed sealer with the state of Rhode Island. Inspections are done on a yearly basis. I make sure these scales are accurate, and if they're not, they don't use them. We got an exclusive look at the series of tests he performs on scales here. This is 50 pounds, and then the indicator will tell us whether it's accurate or not to within a tenth of a pound. Oh, 50 pounds on the nose. 50 pounds on the nose. Eyewitness News also obtained copies of the most recent inspections of every single baggage scale at TF Green. All the scales here were accurate. Good news for local travelers, but we've learned that's not the case at several other major airports in the country. Last year at nearby Logan Airport in Boston, inspectors found 39% of scales in just one terminal were inaccurate. At LAX in Los Angeles, 18% of scales failed inspections. And at JFK in New York, 11% of scales were inaccurate. They want to collect that 50 bucks. Major airports at the top of the list include O'Hare and Chicago, with 97% of their scales accurate, Atlanta at 99% accuracy, and if you're flying to the Sunshine State, Orlando also came in at 99% accuracy. That's very reassuring. Passengers we talked to were happy to hear TF Green weighed in on top. Providence is good, right? <laughs> We've learned if a scale is found to be inaccurate at TF Green, it's put out of service until it's fixed or replaced. Officials say if you think a scale used to weigh your bag isn't working properly, ask the airline to use another scale. Nika Nwosu, Eyewitness News.